Redneck Adventures television show Where Jim, Bob, and Storm will show you where to go For some frog snatching, catfish grabbing, bow fishing, sometimes missing Wrestling hogs, running dogs, tree and coons underneath the moon So for fast and funny action, it's outdoors with a passion All you really need to know it's Redneck Adventures Television Show. Hey, y'all, we're in southern Mississippi today. Can't tell you exactly where because we can't bring a lot of folks here, can we? No, we can't. So y'all stay tuned. We're going to be rabbit hunting. Our good buddy, the Carols. Look at these two smiling. They're not twins. They're like sisters and brothers from different mothers. So the Redneck Adventure is going to be rabbit chasing, bunny central. We got the whole gang. Y'all come go with us. It's bunny time. That everybody leaves here in the same shape we got here, or better. Including the dog. Uh, including the dog. Uh, <coughs> when you're shooting, make absolutely sure that you're shooting at a rabbit. We're not out here. We're not shooting especially dogs. We're not here to shoot armadillos or possums or skunks or movement. Uh, just a Tweety bird flying in the weed. We're out here to kill rats. Um, now, no. most most of us have been uh, have hunted enough that we know what we're doing, uh, particularly with the rabbits. But I can promise you, if you listen to the adults, particularly those like myself, and Mr. Jimmy, and Mr. Ralph. Uh, we rabbit hunt a lot. We know, we can't actually tell you for sure that a rabbit's going to a certain spot, but we have a real good idea of what the rabbits are going to do. If we tell you, go stand on that log, best thing for you to do is go stand on that log. You if you want to get a shot, because this ain't their first rodeo, and he's uh, telling you right. Uh, you can ask William over here uh, how many times I put him in the right spot yesterday. Uh, <laughs> I tell him uh, go stand over there, and he'd kill a rabbit. But anyhow, uh, make sure you know what you're shooting at. Don't shoot toward anybody. Uh, even if they're if you're shooting straight in the ground, uh, don't shoot in the direction that somebody else is. Now, if they're 200 yards, it's, that's different. But it's amazing how far these six shot can go, or seven and a half, or whatever you're shooting. Uh, They'll go 100 yards without any problem. Even though you're shooting down, you know how they spread open? You're shooting this way, it'll throw shells up this way. So we don't want anybody hurt. We don't want any dogs hurt. If you have any questions, ask somebody. We'd rather you ask if it's okay to do something than to do it and get in trouble or get hurt or get somebody else hurt. I have a question. Okay. What about squirrels? Last squirrel season. No, we're not squirrels. Go home. <laughs> You've been around him too much. Didn't we get 200 squirrels last weekend? Yeah, that wasn't enough. That's right, that's right. <laughs> hey, and, and to add to what Mr. Carroll said, gun barrels up at all times. You know, that's that's one of our key deals. Pay attention. You've got a weapon that's, you know, and, and really, I mean, if you if, breached is a real good thing, especially on that over and under. You can leave it, you can leave it folded open and, and you know when it's time for you to get ready for a rabbit's coming towards you, so that, that gun could accidentally, you trip and it go off and we, we will have bad problems and we don't like big <coughs> problems like that. Yep. So when I tell you, Justin, come stand right here where I'm at, I'm not trying to put you in a bad spot. I'm trying to put you where you need to be and I'll go somewhere else. Now if he tells you to come right here and he goes where you were, and he because you're already in a good spot and he wanted to get that rabbit. Right. Hey. <laughs> That's rabbit hunting. I, I gotta do it every now and then. <laughs> we probably should have said that back corner back there. Well. Make a loop. I think he's gonna come around here first. Be ready. Be ready. Be looking out in there. Here, right here, right here. He's right. Hold on, he's right over in here somewhere. Get, Be listening in front. What? Well, you got Mr. Jimmy right here now. Look right, right here, right here in front, right here, right here, right here. Right here. Shoot him again. Shoot him again. <laughs> yeah, right here, buddy. Elmer Fudd. 
How we say that? Talk to me. Breach that gun. We gotta get that ready for the dogs. He ain't going nowhere. Here you go. Here you go. There he is right there. We got him. We got him. We got him. Dead, dead, dead. Here you go. High five. Dead, dead, High five. dead. Hey. Hey, I think you got a little bit of him on the first shot, buddy. Down, 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 down. Hey, 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 hey. You got him. You got him, Big Jason, on the recovery. Let go of that rabbit. Let go of that rabbit. Let go of that rabbit. What do you think I'm doing? Let go. You got him, Just. Go help that man. Squeeze between the jaws. Squeeze between the jaws. I got a camera, it take It's taking a, a big redneck and a little redneck to recover this rabbit, y'all. Keep watching. <laughs> now tell me, get, you know, t give me a little, give me a little commentary there, bub. Huh? Talk to me. Well, Mr. Jimmy said he saw some movement right here. We didn't know what it was. Man, I think Mr. Jason told me a rabbit finally came right here and we shot him. Me, I think I, I don't know if I hit him on the first shot, but I definitely got him on the second shot. So what are we gonna be eating for supper? Wabbit. All right, let's get another one. Y'all keep watching. Tall, tall pine tree when you way up yonder. Look at that. Sporting a Honda Ranger. Rancher, I'm sorry. And another Rancher. And we'll give Honda another plug. That's three Ranchers, four Ranchers, five Ranchers, and a, a foreman. Thanks to the Honda folks. We're out here today. Hey, Jim, look. Hey, yep. His name is Slick. Slick? Slick. Tank the third. So we call Slick. Tank two, that's Slick. That's Slick. And what are you on, sir? I'm on a Honda. Oh. Boy, we're all Hondas out here. It's a Honda. It's a Honda afternoon chasing rabbits in the south. Golly, that could be a country and western song. It's a little, it's a little. If it's a, if it's a little rabbit, do they just bark a little? Well, little rabbits don't smell near as good as a, your grown rabbits. And they struggle running a, a baby rabbit. Well, that makes a little sense. Yeah. A grown person smells worse than a... Baby. Absolutely. There's a lot of grown-ups. Well, I, I don't know. I've smelt some babies <laughs> <laughs> that smell way worse than some adults. And I have, yeah, you I know, some... <laughs> as those adults get older and they turn back into babies, mm, that's why they that's why they make uh, huggies and and depends. <laughs> All right. And that's your smelly tips of the day. B, you ready to kill a wabbit? Kill the wabbit. That's a little bit better tone. I think they're on a strong odor now. Not like one of them weak odors they that comes up. On him. That's that. They stepped <laughs> on it. Sometimes when you get stepped on, that'll make a strong odor. Isn't that right, B? Yeah, that's what we thought. Hmm. Man, how tall are you? Good night. He's ten foot tall. I mean, in Briars must be four foot, but look over there. He's seeing his knees up. That's right. He drank some of that tall water for lunch. We weren't talking to you. We were talking about you. We're talking about how tall you look. <laughs> Too far. <laughs> Dogs are coming this way. We got we got a good race on. 
is fixing to be rabbit central coming right down through this gully. And B is going to score like Drew Brees in the Superdome. Throwing perfect pass. We, we didn't know which side y'all were talking about. We went to the other side. Yeah. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. So, what you got there? Hold that bunny up high, sir. Bunny down. You got a baby. Hey, it's a bunny. Hey, hey. It's a bunny. Sir, we, we were a little bit late. We were a little bit late. Tell us exactly what took place. Oh, you shot the rabbit. You want to smell my barrel? <laughs> Do I want to smell your barrel? Yeah. Not oh, really. Yeah, you just I got a barrel you can smell. Mmm. <laughs> Y'all are so bad. Thing is. All right, what happened? I, I saw. I, we're listening to you. Tell us. I was sitting over there where Jimmy Gamble is. Yeah. Through the breeze, through the weeds. He's over there hollering, you know, nonsense as usual. See the bunny hop out of the road, go back in the briar. So I pull up. Dogs finally come out. So I'm standing on my box. Rap pops up and I'm hollering over at Youngin over there. Saying he's coming to you and then dogs get on me and he just turns and just stops and presents me a perfect shot. Had so to take it. Here's the bunny to prove that I was killed. That's your story and you're sticking to your stinking smoking barrel. Yeah. Okay. I'd say that. All right. The truth is don't pay attention to him. He did kill the rabbit. I didn't shoot. See? Oh, okay. So the truth comes out. All right. <laughs> rabbit, where's he at? Get ready, B. Get ready, B. Anytime you hear that second shot, you know what that means? They missed. All right. Let's kill another one then. They got the rabbit, and we got on the wrong side. Again. What's up with this? Who got that rabbit? Who scored? Who? Uh, B. B. Your daddy did that. Now give us your honest opinion. How do you feel about your dad killing your rabbit? He's a traitor. He's a traitor. Mm. Well, now the truth comes out. Your daddy, I think, missed the rabbit. Did you say you missed the rabbit? Good. He missed the rabbit. Are you hard of hearing or just... What was that song and dance he was singing a while ago? I'm not doing that thing. <laughs> I don't want to look like an idiot like he did. Hey, what's up? I got a bunny. I got a bunny. Oh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, All right. We coming. We coming. What? Which way was he headed? Jason? Huh? That's the rabbit. Safety. Nope, nope, not yet. Did you hear your daddy ask that question, should I go ahead and kill it, as he put the gun to his shoulder and pulled the trigger? B. Please tell me you got that on film. I think, I think I did. I think, I think his words were, should I go ahead and kill it, as he put the gun to his shoulder and pulled the trigger? B, it wasn't your daddy that got your rabbit. It was Mr. Glenn Carroll. So he's hey. not a traitor, is he? Holler game hog. Holler game hog to him. Who? My dad. Holler real loud. Game hog! Game hog! Yeah, game hog! You got Brittany's rabbit! We were, we've been working for hours to get you a bunny, and a game hog took over. Oh, well, we apologize for filming Into the Sun, but <laughs> y'all have a sunny day. <laughs> now, now I, I, believe, I believe what I was seeing on film, I, I, saw you, uh, I saw you raising your gun, and you asked the question, should I kill it? 
as you pull the trigger. Is that, did you kill Brittany's rabbit? Yeah, actually, I did. And, 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 uh... Can you see? It's a real... Let me flip this back. <laughs> There's a real tiny little collar right around here. It has a tag on it that says Brittany. Brittany. But the one thing I will point out, you also, if you really look, all the blood's in the head. I, I just head shoot them when they're running. I can't help it. Wow. But, uh, of course, both legs. Yeah. You know, mm. What you have to do. So, so what should we say about our dads taking kids hunting in the future? Uh, sometimes you push the kids down and, and take their gun and shoot their rabbits. That's what you're supposed to do. Okay. It makes them tough. That's right. The rabbits or the kids? The kids. Oh, okay. Teaches them to be strong. <laughs> Game hog. I'm sorry. <laughs> Wow. We apologize, y'all, as we probably take y'all into this commercial break. We're going to have a moment with fathers and sons and fathers and daughters, daughters talking about taking kids hunting. A bonding moment. <laughs> Wait a minute. We may have to take that last statement back, Brittany. If he, he, he was trying to get her over here. If he comes back with a rabbit. I told him to shoot the rabbit because the dog's been running that rabbit for a while. Okay. Let me see what you got in your hand. I got him. Dead rabbit. Mm. Brittany. Brittany, when you go when you go hunting with these carols. Game hog. Game hog. Mmm. He did. He was trying to get her over there. Okay. We're going to give him... Golly. It's just tough hunting with these Carol boys. <laughs> Brittany. Brittany. Is it your turn to get a rabbit? I think it's kind of like... I think, I think Jason, I think it's kind of like father like son. <laughs> Game hogs just run in the family. Yeah. Okay, we got it. Okay. He was in the front box. A while ago, I got to look and there wasn't one in there. Well, it's a good thing because we blamed you on being a double game hog. I don't care. <laughs> I'd rather be accused of being a game hog than to be the guy everybody picks on because, ha ha, you didn't kill anything today. That's I'm not going to say any names. That's right. Uh, That's right. <laughs> if I just had, if they would just give me a gun. No, I don't need a gun. That would be a scary thing. All right, Brittany's turn. Brittany, what, you missed that what, what did you say? Stupid rabbit treats you for kids. <laughs> I agree. Definitely agree. <sighs> That's right. Uh, uh, uh. We are struggling, folks, across America and other parts of English-speaking the world and other planets. Planets? Planets. Not planets, planets. Pl 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 planet. 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 That uh, we're trying to get Brittany off. a rabbit. Like this way. Hey, Dustin, I got something to tell you. What? Stupid rabbits, tricks are for kids. We gotta go. We gotta go.